क्वेश्चन इज फ्रॉम गेट ट्वेंटी सेवनटीन मैकेनिकल इंजीनियरिंग पेपर सेट वन क्वेश्चन नंबर एटीन द डैम्पिंग रेशियो ऑफ अ विस्कसली डैम्प्ड स्प्रिंग मास सिस्टम गवर्न बाय द रिलेशनशिप एम डी टू एक्स बाई डी टी स्क्वायर प्लस सी डी एक्स बाई डी टी प्लस के एक्स इज इक्वल टू एफ ऑफ टी इज गिवन बाय अमंग दीज फोर ऑप्शन वी हैव टू आइडेंटिफाई वॉट गिव्स द डैम्पिंग रेशियो ऑफ दिस विस्कसली डैम्प्ड स्प्रिंग मास सिस्टम we can write the equation of motion that is the differential equation in this form mx double dot plus cx dot plus kx is equal to f of t where mx double dot gives inertia force component cx dot gives the damping force kx gives the stiffness force and ft is the external harmonic force we are being asked to calculate the damping ratio zeta that is given as damping constant c divided by critical damping constant cc so let's see how cc is obtained c is already known we need to obtain the value of cc so to obtain cc this differential equation is solved for its complementary solution hence it is assumed that the complementary solution xc is a e to the power s t and by putting this in the differential equation, taking the right hand side as zero because we are finding the complementary solution, taking right hand side as zero, we get the quadratic equation m s square plus c s plus k is equal to zero. In order to solve this quadratic equation, let's use the quadratic formula. Hence, the solution s is given as माइनस सी प्लस और माइनस अंडर रूट सी स्क्वेर माइनस फोर के एम डिवाइडेड बाई एम टू टाइम्स एम नाउ दिस कैन ऑल्सो बी रिटर्न एज माइनस सी बाई टू एम प्लस और माइनस अंडर रूट सी स्क्वेर बाय वेन टू एम गोज अंडर द रूट इट बिकम्स फोर एम स्क्वेर माइनस फोर के एम अपॉन फोर एम स्क्वेर हैंस we get s is equal to now the damping constant becomes critical damping constant when this radical equates to 0 there are equal roots for the given quadratic equation hence we put the radical to be equal to 0 so cc damping constant becomes the, the critical damping constant divided by 2m whole square minus k by m is equal to 0 we get cc equal to under root of hence we get cc as 2 root km putting it in the definition of zeta we get damping ratio zeta is equal to damping constant c divided by 2 under root km hence our answer is option b that says damping ratio for this viscously damped spring mass systems is given as c by 2 under root k to learn about damping ratio in detail you can refer to the nptel course module 1 lecture 2 inverse power method it is from the course structural dynamics by dr p banerji he is from department of civil engineering iit bombay i hope the solution will help you clear your doubt thank you